I teach sixth, seventh, and eighth grade. So throughout the year, I have every single sixth grader and every single seventh grader at Eagle Ridge Middle School, and they all cycle through my media literacy class in sixth grade, which is really foundational skills and like, okay, we're in middle school, like these are the things we need to know how to do. And then we also talk about some like online safety and stuff. In my digital knowledge class in seventh grade, we have a lot more freedom to choose the things that we're passionate about. And if they love it, then they can choose my eighth grade classes, which are film and animation and the digital age. I also do a lot of extracurriculars. One of my favorite things to do here is make the school news and I help direct the school plays. My friend Jackie and I co-direct them. So a lot of what I do here is really making rich relationships with kids and like having that excitement about school. There are so many unique things to 191. I think Pathways in itself is a unique experience. So instead of having it be like a traditional schooling system where everyone gets the same thing, it's like starting kids early. Like, what do you like? Who are you? Let's figure this out and then we'll help you blossom as you go instead of you're gonna do the same thing as everyone else. Hope you can figure out who you are after you get out of here. When you first start teaching, people say like, you have to find your people. And I found my people the first time I walked into this building to set up my classroom. And I think that the kids that we have need people who are passionate and fun and focused all at the same time. And if you're not those things, you don't stay. So the people who are left standing are those ones that are champions for kids. Like I want to grow and change and become better every single day. And every single day that I make a stronger connection with a kid or get to know them better, I feel like I'm improving and becoming a better teacher. And I'm gonna need to continue to see the kids in my classroom and be like, whoa, you're way different than the kid I had in the same seat last year. I'm not gonna treat you the same because you're a whole different human being. So now I'm gonna learn you and learn what you need. And I'm gonna do my best to give that to you. And if I don't know how, then I'm gonna learn how to do it. And I'm gonna do that for the rest of my life.